Hey everyone, how y'all doing? Uh, I'm gonna try to link the before and the after videos of our um, vintage holiday Rambler travel trailer together because a lot of people are saying that, well, where's the before? Well, I had started another YouTube channel about, I don't know, a year and a half ago. And the only thing I ever had a chance to put up was um, the before. And now YouTube thinks that if I use that one on this channel, that I'm copywriting. Well, it's mine. <laughs> So anyway, we're gonna try to work it out and see if I can get this done, okay? So here we go. Okay, we bought this camper to rehab. It has some problems as you could see. However, the body we think is in pretty good shape. I mean, we've got some places like right there where we got Bondo, it's places on the door, get rid of the AC, find the emblems you know the windows are great except for the one in the front which somebody put plexiglass in um we're gonna see if we can save this little hatch back here if not we're gonna put diamond plate on it the bumper on this thing is to last for years it's you know this is a 1970s uh holiday rambler and it's a 23 foot uh, we're not sure we're not sure what uh, the name is you know they have like five or six names for each one um, the tongue is in pretty good shape somebody kept that up um, you know we got a few dents in that little piece right there but nothing my son and I cannot fix this is the window that has plexiglass of glass that we're going to have to have glass put in. But the door, I mean the door's okay. Let's go in here. It's kind of rough inside. Um, we got some ceiling damage right there. And um, we're going to put a living area right here. It has this floor put in it, but it's run the wrong way. We're just going to pull it all up because we don't know what's underneath. So, we're going to fix that. Uh, we're going to rip out all of this. Get rid of everything. Probably save the sink and reuse it. Um, we're going to get rid of all this crap in here. We may have to rewire. We're not sure. And, of course, back in the day, they had twin beds, and we're going to put our king-size bed in here. And the bathroom is really gross. But that's okay. And we think we might keep the shower, but we're not sure because my husband is a big man, and he thinks that's not enough room for him. We'll see. Uh, everything else, you know, it's just... A matter of getting all the crap out of here and getting her done. So, until next time. Okay, so now there she is. Uh, brought her back from death. We named her the Phoenix. And uh, we call ourselves the Phoenix Ramblers. As you can see, we fixed all the bad places in her. Got new tanks. Got all new set up here. Got new labels everywhere. Um, she needs a bath. But uh, all the original windows, whoops, fell out. Got an exhaust fan in the um, kitchen. Antenna on top with the antenna connection. We got this saying here on the side that says, All those who wonder are not lost. And of course, we love the Grand Tetons. So we put this here on the side. I'm not finished with that. I wanna put, um, the mountains are calling and we must go. Um, we've got internet and cable here. Of course, we don't have cable cause we'll only have cable if it's offered in the campground or wherever we go. 
I've got new signs here that I painted and put a clear coat on and they actually look original love it uh, let's see new tires uh, new water intake uh, with a new sign here an outdoor shower um, new plumbing goes out to the dump station let's see a marine grade um, shore power connection works fabulously uh, let's see we reworked reworked these and uh, what I did is I bondoed it bondoed it mm. uh, and put uh, used a uh, Valspar, Valspar paint and painted them up uh, we couldn't find the original light so we ended up using these but these here are original and I don't know if you can see that, but it says, As the legend goes, when the phoenix resurrects from the flames, she is even more beautiful than before. Let's see. we still got a few little things to fix here on this little hatch. But he's got his battery and uh, his little meter there. And a power strip. A place to hang the cleaning brush. And, you know, got the lights and the and the jump start back here so that all works good let's see got these little levels on each corner and in the front and the back uh, got our grills out here our tires brand new tires and uh, we use valve spar on those um, on the rims and everything let's see here here, under here, we have an outlet and another ca um, antenna connection. Okay. Okay, here we are on the inside. You can see the doggy in the window. Here's our seating area. Storage in the ottomans. Um, the kitchen looks totally different. It's all nice and bright in here. Brand new AC. Uh, we have storage up top there. Uh, down below here, uh, we have a ice maker and a four-gallon hot water heater. Works fantastic. We leave it on all the time, too. Uh, we have storage there. Let's see. Brand new oven. A big refrigerator. Uh, nice entertainment center with a little fireplace and of course all of our maps and stuff Mr. Childers has to have that uh, let's see here we have a washer and dryer a dehumidifier you have to have a dehumidifier if you live in a humid climate um, big pantry let's see here the bathroom uh, shower here a laundry toilet, little tiny sink, let's see, lots of vertical storage, uh, the bedroom, the bedroom is pretty big, uh, we have storage under the bed, we have a nice widescreen TV, this is storage above for our clothing, and down below, of course, we've got this little area here with the bills and stuff, um, Storage over here. It's a pretty big bedroom for a travel trailer. Uh, I utilized all the space that I could and still trying to make it feel uh, non-claustrophobic. So there you have it. We love it. Nice. I mean, it feels roomy in here to me. So got two ACs, got one in the bedroom with the door. We love our doors. And uh, one in the living area. I want to thank y'all for watching. Uh, I want to thank my subscribers. We almost have a hundred. Uh, please give me a thumbs up on the videos if you like them. If you comment, I'll try to get back to them as soon as possible. Please subscribe and y'all stay free. And above all, enjoy life. Thanks.